I invited a friend. Okay. Hello, sister. <laughs> Hello? Lauren just disappeared. <laughs> she hung up? <laughs> Not a sister scandal. Not this again. Hello, guys. It's me, Nikki. Today, I am joined by the very reason why I am here on YouTube. Please welcome to my YouTube channel, Lauren Conrad. Hi. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, before we get really awkward, I just have yeah. some explaining to do, okay? I agree. So, let's go back to 28, where a very insecure 14-year-old trans girl was in her room watching The Hills Weekend Break on MTV. <laughs> very insecure, doubtful about everything in her life, and then she saw Lauren Conrad's eyeliner, and she was like, what? What's that? Because I only knew about mascara and lip balm and that's it. So I looked it up, I went The Hills Makeup, and there was a makeup artist, Sandy Gold, and she did the Lauren Conrad eyeliner tutorial. It was the first tutorial I ever saw. You are the reason I am here. <laughs> oh, that's so wild. Oh my goodness. How does that make you feel? Well, thank you for having me, by the way. This is like... This is so out, like the fact that I'm filming with no makeup on right now is really right. wild. <laughs> Talk about insecure. I'm like, Girl, with that face, I can't are you believe kidding you do me? this all the time. It's also funny to me that anyone would want to replicate like my attempt at eyeliner back then. It was iconic, it, Lauren. It was iconic. I was just, tr I was just trying to figure it out. <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> From your trial and oh. error, there now is someone um, on YouTube living her best life. So uh, I want to start off this collab. Oh my gosh, that makes me by so happy. Thank you for everything. Um, I'm not going to get emotional in this video, even though I can't make any promises, but oh my God. Today, we are playing no. with your makeup products. I'm very nervous to be doing this, by the way. I've never, I've never like done a video like this. Oh my God, am I taking your YouTube virginity? <laughs> You might be. I've right. never like sat in my room and done. I mean, this is what you do. This is your life. So this is like yep. very oh odd God. to me. <laughs> like I'm I feel very exposed. I did like a deep dive on your channel. I had seen like videos you've done in the past, but I was like, I really need to look at this. Like I need to look at how she lights and right. like you know, interviewing and all of this. And I just like, I stayed up so late one night just like watching videos. I am like in awe of what you can do. I, it's insane. Like you're such an artist. I was like, wow. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> so this line is like very much like an everyday line. And I'm right. sure because you're on camera and off camera, like those are slightly different styles. Yes. So like when I go on camera, I wear pretty different makeup than I would off camera. Amen. And this line I created as like an everyday, um, obviously there's items in here to dress it up with like, you know, eyeliner, like liquid eyeliners and uh, lip colors and like things to kind of dress it up. That being said, obviously feel free to like work in any other products you would don't feel like you have to just do it. this. And I, listen, if you have any tips for me, I'd love to hear them because I'm like, <sighs> this is the most full circle now. moment of my <laughs> life. Do you even know how much you mean to me, girl? Do you even know? Like I wake up every now and then I'm like, Thank God for Lauren Conrad, because if I didn't have you, the world wouldn't have me. Oh my God. She's like, too much pressure, keep it going. <laughs> no, I'm just like, I feel like you're giving me a little too much credit. No, here. listen. You built such like a beautiful thing. I'm like, I don't know you that well, but I'm like very proud oh, of you. you. <laughs> and by the way, when I say I don't know you that well, I mean, I've never met you. I've just watched you on a screen. So I'm gonna apply the foundation with a sponge. Speaking of back in the day, what was your makeup routine like? Obviously there was winged liner. How what, How far back are we going? Like um, 28, 29. Wouldn't that be great? <laughs> wait, wait, I'm 28 or 29? No, 20, no, 2008, 2009. So like the hills oh. period. Oh, oh, oh gosh. Okay. She's like, oh gosh, so, that's far. I gotta be honest, I didn't really have much of a routine. I was like constantly learning and just trying things out. Like half the time, if I look back at like photos or anything, I'm like, oh gosh, I just had no idea what I was doing. Right. I was lucky to work with a lot of different makeup artists and it was like every shoot I went on was like an education. I was like learning something different kind of like figuring out what worked, what didn't. I don't think I had much of a routine. I think back then my my approach, sorry, I'm not even like looking, I hope this is going on because I'm not even looking at myself. I never contoured. I didn't really understand what that meant. I would just sort of like do a more flat face. Right. I don't think like, contouring was a thing back then. It wasn't. Did you do your own makeup? Yeah. Oh, good. I was like, are you about to tell me that my entire youth was a lie and you got your makeup done every episode? <laughs> oh, 
No, 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 no. It's funny, I actually, what, two days ago was talking to Whitney and she was, we were talking about makeup. Right. And she was like, "Is it, it's wild that like, we never had our makeup done. Which by the way, like when I, I don't really watch reality television now, but like when I see clips, I'm like, there's no way. Oh no, honey, they the, all have their all full team. Their they are planning it. They are getting ready for the reality. Mm -mm. Like the Real Housewives, they're all so glam. And I'm like, you, you don't, you, mm -mm, nah. -uh. Would you ever want to be on the Real Housewives? I mean. No, she's no, like, no, no. She's oh like, my never again. You look it's so nice. nice. Thank you. A couple weeks ago, we filmed a collab with Selena Gomez and I had to do my brows on camera. I, know, I watched it. I had to do my brows on camera and she literally grabbed a drink and sat there like, okay, girl, do your thing. It took so long, I was so ashamed. <laughs> I was like, oh crap. Are we concealing? We, oh my gosh, we really are. Take me back to one of your first makeup memories. Oh, okay. I remember my mom, it's like kind of funny now that I'm saying it. My mom was like cleaning out some of her makeup and she was getting rid of a tube of lipstick, like pink lipstick. And I asked if I could have it. And she was like, okay, and this was like, this was like when makeup smelled like makeup. She like also let me have like a pair of like, I think they were like bridesmaid shoes. They were like these pink satin pumps. Oh, They're very eighties. Just that like smell. Like whenever, um, whenever I'd be like shopping for vintage stuff and mm. they'd like open up like those twenties like uh, makeup purses where it's like comes with like a little yes like a little powder and it, like the powder's always gone. But that smell it always just brings me back. That's like my first memory. And then from there, it's all just like weird trial and error. <laughs> trial trying and to figure error. it out. Did your mom teach you how to do makeup or did you just um, figure it out? No, you were like the start. Like I saw that liner on you. I, so I found wild. the tutorial and then I was like, there's more than mascara. My mom always had this like duo eyeshadow and it was like a, 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 like a, a taupe and a champagne color. And I always remember her for like decades, like wearing it. And, saying decades like I'm 45 right now. I remember so vividly that she like put that on her lids. Um, mm -hmm. But no, it, it just, YouTube was my sort of my my makeup school. Now, there were a lot of failures in between. What what do you think is, is one of your biggest makeup mishaps in the past? We're, as you know, like kind of doing press and things a little differently now. So I was sent like a bunch of, uh, a bunch of image like, old images of myself and I had to like record a video talking about them. The biggest thing is like, I would do like a full face. I clearly sat down and did like a full face of makeup and I just wouldn't touch my eyebrows. And they're like all... <laughs> I love that. <laughs> they're very sparse and like not even and overly plucked. And it was like, it was a bummer. You know what the biggest shock to me was that you have to not set it all, but like set your foundation with powder. I, the day I knew you had to set your face, it all changed for me. By the way, I, so I watched your Selena Gomez interview, which was the cutest thing ever. And I don't wear eyeshadow very often. Like I do like little bits, but your palette that you had in there, there was like a unicorn color or something. And I was like, yep. that's amazing. And then I went online to buy it and it was sold out. Oh my God, girl, we can send you 10 or 20. No, but I was like, I was like, Bum, but I was like, come on. Oh my God. Okay, what's next? What are we doing? Do you want to do, do you want to do eyes? You launched two little eyeshadow palettes. What's the response yeah. been like? Cause I saw, I saw some things <laughs> happening over on the internet and I was like, oh, another day, another drama mama. It's been interesting. It's been interesting. I thought fashion was like a scary industry. Makeup's way oh. scarier. <laughs> No, I mean, like I launched a kids line before this and everyone's like, yay, like tiny sweats. <laughs> like, this is so fun. I mean, there, w there was good in it too, right? Please tell me there was good. Oh no, of course there is, there is. And, and it's just like my personality is like, you know, there can be a hundred good copies. I am the bad. same, like, I am the same, I am the same. Let's get to shadow. Okay, yeah. Okay, Let's get so to you're shadow. gonna do shadow. Yes. Okay, so I don't do a ton of shadow. <gasps> So what's not a lot? I usually pick like one. Just one. <sighs> Done. I've always been this, I just don't wear a ton of eyeshadow. You know, I'll pick like a little shine or like, I, I like the lighter ones a lot, just to like a wash. I used to literally just do powder on my lips. Okay, you know what? Um, you know what? I'm up for a challenge. Tell me. I feel like a lot of people on my channel are always like, we, we want to see something more like wearable. We want to see something more like approachable. So today, is the okay. day people. Nikki Tutorials is only gonna use 
Can we do two? Sure. You can use as many as two you want. Two shadows. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I don't even have an eyeshadow brush here. Ooh. I'm gonna show you what I do, I literally. Fine, right, I'm gonna get a brush, I'm gonna get one. Wait, if you have brushes, show me so I can guide you. I will, I will. Like the other day I did um, <laughs> this, the warm color here, uh, brick. brick. I did it as as a liner. And so Love like I that. have like the, the skinny little angled right. brush. I have an eye crease. That sounds well. good. Is it fluffy? Wait, oh wait, 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 I think I found one. Yes, is this it? Yes, better, Woo. better. I'm taking clay, you take a little bit, and we're just gonna, she's so panicked, I love it. I never wear eyeshadow like this, okay, go, go. In your, do you know what a crease is? Yeah, no, I, I know. <laughs> okay, good. Yes, I know what a crease is. In the is. crease, you're just okay. gonna like swoop it around, like a windshield wiper. It's a lot of color. <laughs> <laughs> she said that's a lot of color. Oh, I love it. Lot there. Just keep, <laughs> just keep blending. <laughs> so she's, like, she's like literally never seen me do this. <laughs> Makeup artists used to put eyeshadow on me all the time. Uh -huh. And then I would go to the bathroom and I would wipe it off. Are you kidding me? Why? Because, so in photos, it tends to like shrink my eyes a bit. Right. Okay, so you take that so. and you put it in the crease and yes, and then you do the other eye, of course. And then you yeah. take whatever shimmery color that you like most and then pop that on the lid. You know what the lid is? <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <sighs> Miss Conrad, for, for a woman who doesn't apply lots of shadows to her mm -hmm. crease every now and then, there's a lot of pigment in here, so you did a good job. Oh, thanks. No, I, again, I use them as like, um, I use them as liners. Oh, that's a pretty color. Oh, bitch. Oh, I gotta stop <laughs> swearing with Laura Conrad in the room. <laughs> no, please do. I'm a big fan. So on days you're not filming, do you still do a full face of makeup or do you just kind of save it? No, okay. So on days where I just live my life, I curl my lashes, I put brow gel in my in my okay. brows, I put a lip gloss on and highlighter okay. and that's it. Maybe one day if they're gonna start a new The Hills, I would be a perfect new Lauren. So by the way, they, they, they did. They what? They brought it back. They brought it back? Yeah. Wait, what? Were you on it? No. Oh, see, so who cares? <laughs> oh, no, 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 but the, uh, oh. I, most of the people came back. They did a season, you, I'm, I'm sure it's somewhere. Was it good? Did oh, you watch it? I, I didn't watch, I don't know. You didn't I can't, watch I can't, it? I can't, you I can't, I don't have watch, to. Uh, no, I didn't, I can't watch reality television. Okay, we need to, we need to hear the truth. Was all of it, like, was it like real or did people help out a bit? Were like producers like, hey, Lauren, go talk to, to this person for a second. Yeah, I mean, you know, there's only so much you can do and it's like just not realistic for them to be like, we'll be with you 24 seven unless you're doing like Big Brother. So. Exactly, right. It is time for liner. You're just gonna do liner. I'm just gonna sit okay. here and watch because this is like, whoo, this is happening. I'm sure you do better liner than me. This is like. It doesn't matter. It's what started okay, all right. it all. Okay, 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 okay. This liner is basically, I, I, I combined several that I've used over the years that I really liked and I took things about each one that I liked. So I wanted a really thin tip. It's but actual I wanted, hairs. Yeah, I wanted a brush instead of a felt tip yeah. because I have difficulty getting that really fine point. And I also like the flexibility because the way I do it is I kind of let my lash line steer me. So I press it down against my lash line and then I drag it. The formula, it's very black, but it's pretty thin because I wanted to be able to build because I'm not one, I'm not the type of person who can just like swipe, put it on and be done. Right. So just gonna do it, okay. This is what started it all. I'm getting emotional, I shouldn't look. Oh. Are you? I am, okay. it's so weird. No, it's so weird because just what you're doing right now and like changed my life. It sounds so stupid, but it changed my life. Thank God you're not asking for 5% of my income for this because you would, I would give it to you. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna join you. Do it, let's see. How big are you gonna go? Wait, show me how far you went. Yeah, that's like a, a nice like afternoon line. This is, a, this is an evening lighter for me. You look so golden and pretty. She does know how to do soft and dainty. All right, we're back. I have a lot going on. You went for a couple of individuals. <laughs> we're doing bronzer now, I think. Great. So what products are you still 
like really excited to be working on for the future. We've been developing some more like skincare stuff. So um, Ooh. we have a couple couple masks we're working on Ooh. and stuff. I'm quickly gonna contour my nose. You don't have to do this. So I'll say this, whenever I do that, I look like a mouse. <laughs> what? Well, because my nose is, I don't have like a like a straight, bridge so much it kind of goes like in and out so when I do this it almost makes like the, the round like the tip of my nose look kind of more like a little ball oh but that's it's not cute, cute though so it's it's not trust no. me I just started highlighting my nose though was isn't that revolutionary I really only started using it in the last like year and a half <gasps> a late um, bloomer very late I did like little bits but like as far as like a daily routine like just kind of for everyday makeup I wasn't doing it and I just started doing it to give my face a little light you know what my favorite thing is to put um moisturizer on so you're like already have like that dewiness going on and then popping highlighter mm -hmm. on top of your moisturizer you're gonna look so radiant usually what I do now is blush Okay, so we have two powders and we also have a lip and cheek. So I do a couple different ways. Like I sometimes wear both. Okay, go ahead, um, girl. And I layer. You can do one, you can do the, you know, whatever. I'm mixing the two powders. Oh, you're mixing them. Look at you. You wear all the makeup. So you have a good face for makeup. I like when I went to put too much on, it looks silly. I would love to see you in like a, a very soft, like blown out smoky eye, but like smoky in the way that it's like blown out and hazy. Yeah. Oh, and then with a like a wet chrome lid. Oh. A chrome lid? That lid color that I'm wearing right now is so pretty. I kind of want it as a cheek highlight. Ooh. I've had a full face of makeup in my house in so long. Ooh. The kids are gonna be like, who do you think you You're are? You're gonna get so glam for the living room. <laughs> I love it. All right, what's next? Lips? With all this eyeshadow on. <laughs> With lips, I've always done like either like a color or nothing. Like my poor makeup artist is like, please just like this subtle. And I'm like, chapstick, go. Got it. But this is a special occasion, so we can do whatever we want. I would probably do, like if I was gonna do one of the lipsticks, I would probably just do shell. I know that's not super exciting. I or, that. I mean, we can do like the- I picked shell as well. You have yeah, shell? Make me happy. Ooh, I love that. It's <sighs> a lot with the shadow. A lot of makeup for me. <laughs> I love how we're polar opposites where you're I like, know, this is I a know. lot. And I'm like, this is such a soft day for me. You know what my favorite thing about that is, is that even though like our preferences in makeup are so different, we still have that same common love for like products and like mm -hmm. how happy it can make us. I feel like makeup is such a universal, like lovable thing. That's what I love about it. Yeah, it's such a special time when you can just like sit down, like the focus is completely on yourself. Right. And it's like a right. ritual. You're like, this is me time. I'm just just trying to like match the way I feel yeah. in the mirror. <laughs> like, I just want to look how I feel. What is that one thing you said on the hills, that, that one iconic quote? You had that beautiful mascara tear running down your face. Oh, I want to forgive you and I want to forget you. Yes! Is that yes. It? Oh, we okay. need to film that at yeah. one point so I can use it to promote the video. <laughs> I want to forget like, you. Hello, guys. It's me, Nikki. And you go, I want to forgive you and I want to forget you. Bye. <laughs> I will tell you, though, it's kind of funny. The tear thing, they slowed down the shot to make it like more dramatic. Oh, I love that. I remember because I was watching, I was like, oh my gosh. And my producer was like, yeah, we slowed down the shot. So it just went really cool. <laughs> I love that. Well, I don't, do you want to do anything else to the face? Absolutely not. <laughs> this is so much makeup for me. And I had fun playing with eyeshadow. I promise I'm not going to take it off. Yes, I am. Yes, <laughs> take it right off. We mm -hmm. mentioned in the video earlier today how your welcome into the the beauty community has been a little. And just because I want my next career move to become Dr. Phil, <laughs> I invited a friend. Okay. Hello, sister. <laughs> Hello? Can you hear us? Lauren just disappeared. <laughs> she hung up? <laughs> Not a sister scandal. Not this again. Oh my God, my computer just <laughs> turned off. <laughs> You're kidding. I'm dead. Wait, can you see me? My computer no. just died. <laughs> I'm so glad to have my friends here because I just wanted to show the community that we are a loving place and we welcome everybody. And I want to show the world that we ain't that toxic because look, 
we have Dr. Phil over here to fix things. I'm kidding. <laughs> Everybody, of course, has bad days. Nikki, you know why I had a bad day that particular I day. I know, <laughs> honey. Lauren literally handled it like an absolute professional, like she is. And we talked via DM, and I just am really grateful that she was so kind and understanding. And we talked it out. She sent me a new package of not empty products, and I was super excited to try them out. And they're phenomenal, and it's all good to go. Can I just tell you, I literally I'm like in the front yard playing with my my kids and my phone I looked down I have all these messages on my phone and I was like what's going on because it's like end of work day and I look at a text and it's like this long thing it's like wait what happened how did this happen and they were like the manufacturer did and I'm looking at it and I was just like <gasps> I'm just very very grateful that you were so kind and we were able to talk it out and be good because the last thing that I ever want is drama and you're just like literally the sweetest and you're like the hills came before my time like i was a tiny little kid when it was out but it just goes no to show, like, james you said you sent me a video you were like i was zero years old and i was like how old does he think i am <laughs> <laughs> once again i just appreciate you being oh my so God. About it. okay well <laughs> thank you it's very sweet and you're fantastic and thank you so much nikki tutorials the Love channel people. where people come together oh thank my you God. <laughs> This is our look all done. Lauren, thank you so, so much for thank today. You, for you cannot understand how surreal and just full circle this is to me. It sounds stupid, but I feel like we've been friends for years and like we're just catching up and just having fun. And thank you, honestly. Thank you so much. Honestly, I think you're amazing. I'm so excited to do this with you. And um, I really hope we can do this in person someday. It would be yes. my dream. So in every video I do, there's a Dutch word of the day. I know this. You can already guess what today's word is gonna be. Yeah. Today's Dutch word of the day is for hills. Bergen. Not even gonna try. Bear? Like bear? Like, like a bear? Okay, bear. Gen. Gen. Bergen. <gasps> Good job! Did I do it? Yep, you just said the hills. Okay guys, so if you wanna get featured in my next video, all you have to do is leave the Dutch word of the day down below in the comments. Who knows, you might see your face pop up in the next one. I wanna thank you again so much, Lauren. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And hopefully, I will see you guys on the next one. I'm gonna go cry in the corner now because my life is complete. Bye. <laughs> I'm literally. She's taking uh, it off! Uh, She's uh, taking it oh off! Oh my God, who's this girl? Who does she think she is? <laughs>